Yes, believe in Hamill. Those are my three words for Motherwell. Oh, I'm happy with that, by the way. Right. Because, okay. you know, we're, we're sitting effectively like we're third bottom in the league now. And there's, don't get me wrong, there's no points in it for, for basically hearts all the way down. There's absolutely nothing in it. But, you know what, Peter, even in terms of body language, which I saw when he took over his first game at Motherwell, and there was a proper Motherwell guy down on the touchline, down in the technical area. I remember finding that very impressive. We then watched how the style of play um, night and day compared to what we were watching under Graham Alexander and I must say as well and this is, I think this would be rare for any manager at any club I've never known so few Motherwell fans to pick holes in a post-match interview do you know what I mean by that? Sometimes your manager will come out after the game and he doesn't seem to speak the language of the fans or he, he's watching a different game for us but I think he's been very very honest and he's been the same uh, level. He's a Motherwell fan himself. He's, he's been in that level with us and, and, and saying what he thinks has to be said. And, you know, so I'd, I just hope as much as we could do with um, some air results, I mean, that, that's, I think that's now just 1 in 11. Yeah. Uh, we've actually um, won. Um, so, you know, um, I, I, I think he's absolutely the man for the job. Just let him bed in, let him get to a transfer window, and we'll see how the season pans out.